so much for coming. I'm Krishna Winston. I'm chair of the Little Town Recycling Commission. And we're gathered today to celebrate the installation of 10 of these beautiful barrels uh, for recycling on Main Street. We're going to have a very brief ceremony. We have a few speakers. I would like to call first on Joyce Kirkpatrick, who was chair of the Commission on the Arts at the time that this project was first proposed. She's worked tirelessly to make the arts a reality in Middletown, and we're very happy that she supported this project, and she's going to say a few words. Joyce? Um, it's, it's a privilege to be here to represent the Arts Commission um, and I see a number of members of the Arts Commission with those who are now or have been uh, on the Arts Commission including a number of our council people please raise their hands we've got Jen Lecce over here and Steve Allison our coordinator and yeah it's great to see you here I think the arts are really an integral part of the city, but it's not because of me, it's because of all the people in the arts, and that's, that's very important. Um, the commission is really pleased to be here uh, as part of the dedication, because we uh, received an application from Pierre Sylvain, the artist, uh, and awarded him a grant to help with the creation of these wonderful barrels. That was last fall. And the results of Pierre's project have certainly pleased the commission very much. So thank you, Pierre. This, uh, this project actually makes me think of Steve Jobs, whom we and the world have just lost. Through his Apple products, he gave mo more than most people are able to give. He gave a new way of thinking about the world and a new way of communicating. Um, and what makes me think about him today is that he always insisted that his technical products be beautifully designed. He wanted them to be beautiful. And today we are dedicating these new recycling collection <coughs> containers, which I think are over there. Um, I hope you've all had a chance to look at them because they are so beautiful. They are so vibrant with their joyful colors, and they sing of this planet's beauty that is all around us and that we must care for. They show us a new way of thinking. They show us a way that we can care for our precious planet. And so at this moment, Pierre Sylvain, hello Pierre, you are the Steve Jobs of Middletown. <laughs> the love and energy and talent that you have put into this project that will adorn Main Street. So when the snow flies this winter, we can all look at this art and we will feel cheered and warmed and re-energized knowing that we have taken a small step in preserving the earth. So thank you, Pierre. Thank you, thank you very much, Joyce, for this really very well chosen words. Now I'd like to call on Billy Russo, the Director of Public Works, who's been a supporter of this project and also a great supporter of the Recycling Commission. Billy? Good morning, everyone. Uh, thank you for having me here. Um, Pierre, I think, came to us about a year ago with this project, and uh, it, it, it's one of many projects that we see in Public Works, and now that I look at it, I think it, it, it's going to grab everybody's attention on Main Street. It's a, it's a fantastic project, but the energy that he brought, he had Kim O'Rourke with me, us getting the funding for projects like this, I think it's, it's huge, it's important downtown that we start our recycling here. Um, I, I always enjoy working with the Arts Commission, I enjoy working with the Recycling Committee, and uh, just the energy that's brought forward. But uh, Pierre, they're, they're excellent. We're already getting comments on, on how it dresses up the area versus just a regular green barrel. And a lot of people are paying attention to it. Um, other than that, as I said, we will continue to, to work with people like yourself and these projects and everything that Kim brings forward. And the um, um, mayor is always very supportive of these projects as the rest of the commission is here. So, Pierre, congratulations. Kim, good work and to the recycling committee. 
and we'll continue to work hard on everything that you guys bring forward. Thank you. Our next speaker is Ron Plattenberg, <coughs> who's a neighbor of CARES and uh, a great <coughs> supporter of environmental causes in the city of Middletown. Thank you very much, Krishna, and appreciate that. And, um, you know, on behalf of the Common Council, I'm, I'm grateful for being given an opportunity to say just a few words, but also with us to see uh, this morning are uh, Mayor Sebastian Giuliano, uh, Councilman Casina, Councilman Faulkner, Councilman Kukowski, uh, Councilman Bauer, and a few others. And we collectively, uh, as elected officials, have been supporting the arts in many ways uh, over the years, and I, I know that this is one of the most exciting projects uh, that we have been involved with in the in recently. Many of you probably uh, remember the sculptures that were on Main Street. And for many of us, myself included, um, I thought it was a, a really serious loss when the sculptures were removed because those sculptures provided sort of a uniqueness, a quality to the streetscape, and um, Except for the senior center, of course. That was a whole different story. <laughs> Everyone else uh, felt a great loss to the quality of Main Street for people who are visiting and walking along the streets. Uh, Pierre has recreated this feeling, uniqueness of the city of Middletown, the uniqueness of Main Street, and being able to walk and have art become part of the experience when you're here in Middletown. And I want to congratulate the Arts Commission, I want to congratulate the Recycling Committee, um, and because it was their vision to bring recycling to Main Street, prevent people from throwing trash into the garbage and rather putting it into recycle barrels. The arts community for years has been looking for opportunities to promote our art heritage. Councilman Christina is here too. Uh, but, but, but promote the arts for the city of Middletown. <coughs> and Pierre, I know from uh, seeing him work extremely hard over the course of the summer, he has put into these barrels a certain uniqueness that is comes from his heart. And what you're seeing is a is a are barrels that are unique and special, every one that he painted. And he spent a lot of time working on this project. I just want to read something that was written about our, uh, Pierre's artwork. The art of Pierre Sylvan is a surreal journey into his world of surreal, Dali-like imagery. At times, Pierre's Haitian heritage can be seen in the use of vivid colors. Pierre's unique take on cubism is, com is coupled with a Picasso-like rendering of the human form. Pierre's musical and landscape works take on a whimsical feel. When viewed in person, it is very surprising to see the many three-dimensional elements and mediums that Pierre is also is able to seamlessly infuse into his various paintings. We have a unique opportunity. We were great, extremely grateful for Pierre to put his heart and energy into this project. I hope it doesn't end here. I hope this is just the beginning. We need more art. I challenge the art community to bring more art opportunities here to the city of Middletown. Congratulations to all.